Hi, this is Kushbu with another question of triangles. This is question number 7, the exercise 6.2, page number 1 to 9 of NCRT. It is using theorem 6.1, two the line drawn to the midpoint of one side of a triangle, parallel to another side bisects the third side. That means, how many triangle we are at? Keep triangle. So, this is A. This is B and this is C. A long line drawn to the midpoint of one side of the triangle. Triangle ki ek side se line draw hai. To the midpoint of one side. Let's suppose agar ye D hai, ye midpoint hai AD ka. That means ye AD equal hogi BD ke. Parallel to another side. Ye kuchh side ke parallel. Let's suppose this is D. So matlab BE is ke parallel hai. Bisect the third side. Third side ko bisect kar rahe hai, hai proof kar rahe so given a comment ki ad equal hai bd ke because d midpoint hai aur we given hai bd parallel hai bc ke two three two ke upar aata hai ki hame prove karna hai ki this E bisects AC. Ye isko bisect kar raha Bisect kar raha matlab half na divide kar raha That means AE equal hai EC. AE equal hai EC ke. Hmm. Ab hume pata hai ki jab line paagi hoti hai. Paagi ka matlab hai ki ratio is equal hona chahi. So, in triangle, ABC as BE are in a BCK by Hale's theorem AD by DB equal over AE by ECK AD by DB equal over AE by ECK that means, agar ye se equal hai, or AD by DB mein AD equal to BD ke, so this can place the place of AD by AD is equal to AE by EC. This ye chiyo se equal hai, so this can place the place of the same So, ye cancel over aray hai maare paas, 1. So, 1 is equal to AE not EC. Ye EC idha chala chala hai, then jayega EC is equal to AE. So, EC AE ke equal hai. So, E and G is equal to the E midpoint. Hai. So, therefore, E is the midpoint of AC. E is the midpoint. So, we have basically use midpoint by use karke. So, we have to use equal to This was question number 7, 6.2, page number 1 to 9 of NCRT. If you doubt so, please do write to us. So, Nietzsche says, give us a little key or a little eye. And do watch the next video for some more questions. Good luck.